Okay, hello. I'm LP Racist, and I'm doing a Pokemon hack of Pokemon Red called uh, Pokemon Brown version. This is a bit an older hack, and the guy that does it is not too much on hacking anymore. I mean, once in a while now. But as you can see right there, right through him, it's going to have some Johto Pokemon. And I haven't played too much of it. But I plan on playing some. I'm not really sure how that's pronounced. Rion, I think. Re Rion. I'm not really sure. It's wherever this um, what this region's called. <laughs> Timothy. Well, yeah, it's 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 a pretty good hack so far that I've seen. I've probably gotten like three or four badges, but. But that's as far as I've been so far. Um, really like this. It's, uh, I believe this hack is based on a, um, uh, based on kind of like a region next to, uh, Ken Kanto. Not really sure. Oop. I, I forget at the moment, I, I read some of it a while ago, but that was a little while ago now, when I first had, I checked out the game and played it for a bit. Yeah. Oh, um, with this game, of course I'm going to be choosing Charmander, and I like that they have some of the newer sprites and some of the older sprites to the game but they got some third gen sprites in this which is pretty cool um, but they're all in like black and white so it's kind of weird and um out of all the cause I'll, be, I'll be battling pretty soon so you can go and battle pretty pretty early on uh, I've forgotten a bit of this game already. Uh, where's the professor? Is it down this way? It must be. I don't remember too well. Oh, yeah, there it is. Uh, the last time I played this was not too long ago. Still kind of working on it on a different uh, computer. It's a it's not a bad game. I'm gonna choose Charmander and probably go through whatever I can. But um, what I was saying earlier is I'll be battling pretty soon in the wild, and I would suggest not um catching a Pidgey. A gust is a wind type, it was changed. And it's really not effective against anything. I've tried several, um, several different, like, Pokemon, and gust was just not worth it. I'll probably pick up a Spearow or something if I can find one. And I see that Charmander Sprite at third gen. Uh, squirrel spice from yellow version. So I'm not sure, but I think I should go through and catch every Pokemon and battle all the trainers, so that way you guys know what uh, what Pokemon there are and things like that. And that way you can find what you need. Ooh, I should have probably healed there. Oh, lucky me. I've had moments in this kind of game where. I'd be like, oh, I'm lucky I get to hit again, and then all of a sudden the wild Pokemon or the trainer's Pokemon will hit first for some reason. Just totally beat me up. I had that happen not that long ago, and I was like, what? How did... Yeah. So I'm kind of excited because uh, the last time I was playing this game, I didn't really see any Johto Pokemon. Okay. So I don't remember where to go and talk to some people. Oh, I, I got kind of lost the first time. 
Oh, right. Yeah, it, this is kind of like... It, it uses some of the same scripts from Red, Yellow, Blue. So I have to do a delivery to the professor. Kind of like in, you know, Red, Yellow, and Blue. But this time it's a pizza and not a Pokedex. But I'll still be... I'll still be getting the Pokedex or whatever. It's kind of weird. Yeah, so far it's uh, pretty good. I, I had a pretty good team going, though I had a slowpoke and Kadara on my team. I was hoping the slowpoke would learn something water, but I guess that's where he's slow. So he was not learning any water, and this SP attack or whatever it's changed to in this game was not very good. And it was okay. I wasn't really expecting to catch the arrow that I caught. Once I caught it, I raced it up and it was beasting. And I'll, I'll probably do quite a bit of battles too, but also do a lot of battles uh, outside. Or just do enough battles that you can get an idea of what Pokemon are in what areas. First, I gotta find those areas. Oh, no way! I gotta have cut for that. I totally forgot about that. I need to come back here in my in my other game and cut down some trees. Uh, uh, I just remember there's this one spot later on that you you get done like battling like level seven or something and get in this one spot in level sixteen. I was like, what? So that's later on. But now that the book march not all clogged up now. I'm gonna buy some football. I'm not really a potion user, so won't be getting any of those. So this is kind of hard game though. It's not like super hard, but at times you'll your Pokemon will just get the crappy now. Oh, I remember, I did quite a bit of training in here. Might as well find what Pokemon are in here. While well, I can. Scratch. I think I lost my battle the first time when I was playing. Because I don't remember having a level 5 or level 6 Charmander through this part. And, uh, it's actually not bad. I'm, it's not really many Pokemon in this area. I think there's like three or four different Pokemon. But it's enough. I think there's... Oh, there's Zubat right there. Um, Jidu, Clefairy, and Diglett. I think those are the Pokemon. I don't remember too well. I did catch a Diglett when I first came through here. Probably gonna do that again. And... No, I'm gonna catch up Pokemon I can. As well. Alright. What's got? Now I would raid Zubat for a Crobat if it's possible, but I don't think so this time around. Maybe in a different LP. Uh, let's see if we can find anything more than the Zubat. I don't want to go deeper in because deeper in, I think I will. Another battle to go through. I kind of want to avoid that because I remember it was not so much strong, but not really. Of course, before I even left this area when I was playing originally, I raised all my Pokemon to like 10 to 8 or something. Or 8 to 10, I mean. I do remember uh, my Diglett. That, the Diglett was getting wailed on my first time through. And I, I, why am I only seeing Dubats? Uh, there wasn't nearly this many Dubats my first time through. In fact, I had hardly seen any. This is very unlucky. Um, maybe I will go a little deeper in. Especially since Charmander learned them. 
Wait, oh, wait, oh, yeah, there, there's a chimney there. Let's see what's in here. God! Two bats! Two bats everywhere! Oh, now that I said that, it kind of reminds me of the, that mean picture with Woody and Buzz standing there. And Buzz will say something, something everywhere. And Woody would have a terrible face. Like, totally unhappy. I totally see that. Be kind of hilarious. Oh, Robux. I'm not really big on the other fire type Pokemon. In fact, I'm kind of a weird trainer. You know, I, I get that normal where you get like multiple, or not multiple, but you get like different kinds on you. And I'm a bit weird because I always kind of go for the same Pokemon. Or the same. Like every time. Like if I can get a Abra, I'll go for it. And depend on how I, I'm doing, like last time through, I uh, grabbed a, what was it, a Bell Sprout and raised that up. And there's something about Bell Sprouts, they're like strong, but at the same time, they don't learn too much. But I, uh, beaten the fourth gym leader, which I believe was a grass type, just like Erica. I'd beaten her in, uh, oh, I don't like that lagging, but I keep letting go of the pause. The only reason why it seems normal is because I'm holding down the speed button. But, yeah, oh, so now my Pokemon is healed. Um, I have that Zubat on me. I want to go in there and catch something new, but I don't even know what's over in that grass area. Um, yeah, let's see if I can see anything else. So yeah, there should be Clefairy in the tunnel. I kind of want to get one. At the same time, I want to get uh, Diglett and, and Geodude if there's Geodude. Um, Yeah, I'm just gonna continue. Cause there's just too many. Um, yep, maybe I will race to see that. Just because it's like my only other Pokemon. Not very high level either. Oh, really? A Zubat. There's an item over there. We'll see what that is when I get there. Ooh, oh, Rat Tata. It's like. I think Leech Life is slightly stronger than it is in normal game, but only slightly. You can see it's doing quite a bit of damage. It's normally too bad to like super weak and just can't handle anything. But that Rat Tata might use a Taco or something to do super, no, yeah, super damage. Oh, I don't know if I can. Oh. Got another one on him. Can't tell if he's gonna. Nope. Got lucky. Yeah, I'll switch over to Charmander now. I'm kinda happy though that the two bats are slightly stronger. So I might just raise the zoo bat because Pidgey, freaking useless. Died so often when I was trying to train him. Like, really often. And all he had was. Gust for a physical attack, or just attack in general. I mean, which was super annoying. So I'd like sitting there running around trying to go level him, and he would just not go. I'm gonna go heal again. Uh, also, um, I didn't mention, but I'm gonna be doing some other LP with a bunch of friends. And that's that's kind of the reason why I'm doing this is because I'm kind of waiting till we start. Give me health. Okay. I wonder how bad my voice sounds. Maybe it's just me, but 
I don't like my voice too much. I remember when I was younger though, my voice was always a lot deeper than normal, or not normal, but for the average 10 year old. But now it's like really high in comparison to some people, but I used to talk a little bit different when I was younger. So my voice would always seem kind of heavier, a little rougher. No, it's not like that. Though. Oh, there's a Jidu. Hmm. I think I will catch him. Give him dig later. I don't mind you about uh, my Doug Trio, or in my other game I did it. So I raised him to a Doug Trio. Oh, I just remember a benefit of Charmander. He learned uh, Metal Call later on. That's kind of good. I, um, I don't know if I should mention this, but I think I will. Um, when uh, I'm done with this, I think I'll try out the sequel to this game, which involves uh, a little bit of this region, we we on or something, and uh, a new one, because the uh, the hack, the hacker guy that made it uh, cool. Man boy or something made this. Uh, he made a sequel, or he's making the sequel because he's still sort of working on it. He's not really. The last thing he put up a beta for uh, for the other one was about two years ago. So I can't really imagine it's really going anywhere. But we might find out sometime. Well, I'll probably mention it. Also, I'm going to put links to this if anyone wants to get it. It's pretty fun. I mean, it's, it's not amazing, but it's not bad. I mean, the guy made a complete, a completely new region. I just feel kind of like it's uh, sort of cluttered up. It's not bad. There's a few other hacks I might do as well. There's a couple of them in particular I'm interested in, and two of them are like really similar to each other. So, I'm kind of interested in doing that and see the difference, but because I haven't gone through them. But if I if I actually beat this game, then I'll move on to one of those. I always do that. I always just click again. Okay. Well, what else am I do? I can... Well, it's getting pretty close to ending though. Not too close. Yeah, I think I should end the video here. So this is end of episode one. Bye.